Ryan Laundry for a second. The search for him is intensifying. He was named a person of interest in her disappearance last week. And right now, several law enforcement agencies are searching for him in the Carlton Reserve. Fox 13's Kimberly Kuzan joins us there live tonight. Hi there, Kim. Uh, first of all, we know that Gabby's death has ruled to be a homicide. That's a significant development because it confirms what many had suspected, but we did not know for sure. Uh, do we know if Brian is now considered to be a suspect then in this case? Well, Mark, publicly, investigators are still calling Brian Laundry a person of interest. But this begins as the search here at the Carlton Reserve intensifies. And the reserve is 25,000 acres of trees, trails, snakes, alligators, and who else knows what. This is like a ride I like to do to get away from it. Those coming to the Carlton Reserve's Venice entrance found it shut down and filled with investigators searching for 23-year-old Brian Laundry. To see this and to see what happened is horrifying in our own little community. The reserve contains 25,000 acres. Laundry would need to rely on survival skills to stay in the hot, muggy, and swampy terrain. I ride my bike out there quite often, um, and. You just sink in. It's not worth it. Um, there's so much water. Like normally when you go out there in the uh, wintertime when it's dry, you see all kinds of alligators. There's so much water, you don't even see the alligators. Uh, I wouldn't want to be out there. Norfolk Police Department provided this video, the terrain inside the reserve, and the obstacles investigators are facing as they search for Brian Laundry. Basically take this wood field. You're going to see the, the High altitude drones that can zoom in, along with swamp buggies that can get into marshy areas, are being put to work as investigators work against conditions they call unforgiving. We're expecting to get, uh, to get wet by the end of the day and check the entire area for Brian Landry. Here at Carlton Reserve is underwater. So, where is Brian Landry? That's the question that remains, and that's what investigators are working to answer. Now, I can tell you earlier today, Governor Ron DeSantis allocated even more people to this search effort. He allocated the FWC and funds to come out here and help at the search site here at the Carlton Reserve. Now, we did see them out here, but the search continues to intensify as everyone tries to lay eyes on Brian Laundry and find his location. Mark, back to you. Yeah, so many questions that uh, potentially he could help answer. Kim, thanks.